It was a game changer. Definitely. Yeah. These jars of golden colored goodness are. Look at that. I am so weak. I also hurt my hand last week. I am so weak. I can't even open this. This is real. This is really happening. Pickles might be having a real moment right now. Right now, we're in an absolutely unprecedented situation. I don't know what to do. I don't know what I did to deserve this. Are you serious right I, I, I'm trying. John, okay? no, 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 you're not. You're really but not. But it's not my fault to steal like this. Like, do you want to try? Then you, you try. Here, like, wait, like, look, get a knife. Let's get a knife. Here. No, you can't open it. I'm telling you, it's not going to work. I'm fine. Oh my gosh. You're like, I can open it. Just come, come here. I come home from work one day and there are a bunch of police cars parked outside. So naturally I rush in to see what's going on. And I remember not wanting to assume that the worst had happened, but I walk in and there it was, this jar that John had brought home and it, it doesn't open. We're really in a pickle now. It's an anomaly. Quite simply, every jar that is made is meant to be opened. I've never seen anything like this in my 30 years of practice. The design of a jar is specifically crafted so that it remains sealed until a centrifugal force of 90 degrees is applied from the top of the jar. And this is going to have deep, deep political and societal consequences. Okay, so what if we... But I... I, I just think just that... shut up, John. There are vast political implications because of this jar not opening. The president has been addressing it every day for hours during rallies, pressers, and Twitter tirades. Geopolitical relations have never been more tense and it really comes down to one concept, the possibility of impossibility. If that jar never opens, it's a big deal. The biggest deal since Watergate. This actually explains why Trump had such a big voter turnout this year. You know, I was thinking maybe I should call the Coast Guard tomorrow um, or the police officer. Actually, I have a friend who's very strong and maybe he could like open... I can't do this anymore. Well, I could get rid of the jar and could sell the Pawn Stars or something. No, John. I, I can't do this marriage anymore. My entire newsroom is reporting on this story. I haven't slept in three days. And I'm probably going to die reporting on this. Yes? Are you allowed to be here? Are you? Yeah, I'm part of the, uh, the film crew filming the documentary inside. Uh, they're wondering if you're part of our crew, but you're not. I'm here to take a photo of the pickle jar. Dude, I think they're going to call the police on you, man. Um. I, mean, I thought you had a permit. What do you mean? You can't do this marriage anymore. I just can't. No, no, you vowed to be with me through thick and thin. This is it? Are you serious? This, this, this is what we vowed. Could you, could you have imagined but, that this would really? happen? Could you have predicted this at all? Right now. No, this is not within my control. I've been trying and trying. But it's not work. What? No, not you. You. How, how do I do what? 